Hello everyone. In the previous video, we filtered the ALV output based upon username, user OCT15. And we learned what are the parts of the select option, how you can filter based upon single value. Now, filtering can be based upon range also. We are filtering based upon excluding some values also. So we will see that part also. For time being, I will comment this filter. We will take a requirement and we will do the filtering. Suppose I am running this program without any input. All data is coming in the output. If you can see the category column, we have the values C is there, I is there, we have H is also there. You can see we have the various values A, B, C, D, H is there, I is there. Now suppose customer is saying, I only want the records where sales category is from A to D. So in that case, what we will do with the help of coding, we will filter based upon range. We will pass the range of this category as A to D. We will see how to do this. I will simply make a copy because everything will remain the same. Now you are filtering based upon which column. The column name for category is VP type. It is VP type. Now, we all know and in the previous video, I explained if you are going for low value and high, if you are going for range, the relational operator is between. Now, what is your from value? A. And what is your to value? The two value is D. You are filtering based upon sales document category A to D. This is the way you can pass a range. If I will go to execute and show you the output. Now you can see we have C category. We have A category, B category. We have D category, but you can see H and I are not there. So this is the way we can go for range. Suppose now we will go for some excluding example also. Suppose If you see, we have the line item number 10 is there, 20 is there, 30 is there. Now what customer is saying? I do not want 30. In my output line item number 30 record should not come. So you can exclude this particular value. How we can achieve this? I will simply make a copy. Now we will go for our column. Our column name is Postnar now, LT final. Now the relational operator is exclude, exclude. You are excluding a single value. And what is the value you are excluding? 30. 1, 2, 3, 4, 30. We should clear the work area after every append statement else what will happen this two value will also reflect here if you are not clearing this work area if you will not clear this work area suppose simple this vb type replaced it replaced it replaced it replaced it replaced but there is nothing to replace the two values. So what it will do? It will take D here also. And that is not our case. We only want the line item number 30. So that's why I'm clearing the work area. 
so everything will be cleared and we are filling the work area again important point because many people will do these kinds of mistake so what we are doing we are going for two filtering scenarios we are filtering based upon the sales document category range a to d and we are excluding the line item number 30 if we will see i'll show you in debugging mode so that it will make more sense i'm executing if you will see lt underscore filter we have the range a to d for the sales document category we are excluding the line item number 30 if i will go to execute you can see now we do not have line item number 30 we have a to d sales document category a line item number 30 also excluded so this is the way how you can do the filtering based upon the coding also yes filtering is a functionality in alv inbuilt functionality but many time customer always ask these this kinds of scenarios they want to filter based upon range they want to filter based upon single values they want to exclude some values so in that case you can achieve this particular requirement through coding so that's it in this particular video thank you